Compass Publishing. Welcome back to the International Sports Network. I'm your host, Eva Henderson. Before we wrap up our show this evening, let's talk about how cooperation through sports can create cooperation in areas outside of sports. The 2018 Winter Olympics in Pyeongchang, South Korea, was a special and successful event. One thing that made it so special was that the North and South Korean teams decided to march together during the opening ceremony. They did so under the unified Korean flag. In addition, the two countries also competed together in the Women's Ice Hockey Olympic event. This marked the first time the two countries competed together since 1991. Both nations have celebrated this cooperation. In fact, there was even a popular South Korean movie made about the unified Korean athletes who, in 1991, competed together at the 41st World Table Tennis Championships in Japan. Since then, Both countries have cooperated in other areas as well. One example is the Gaesung Joint Industrial Complex, which was formed in 2004. This is a large area where North and South Korean companies and workers do business together. Surely, the history of competing together in international sporting events has helped the two nations cooperate in areas outside of sports. That concludes our show this evening. Remember that there are many ways we can get over our differences and work together. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.